Hi and welcome back to Surviving Mars. We're now at Sol Day 200 and we have two settlements or two main areas of settlement currently running. This area is the mining district which was providing all the rare metals. Currently we have one person homeless and two people unemployed. Let's have a see if we can actually address this. There's one person available here, so let's have a look for this homeless person. Oh, there isn't. There's two people homeless. Whichever way, it doesn't really matter. We're going to need to get some homes in here. So, let's have a look at building that there and I think because we're going to get these people living here we really need to put in a gross there and let's leave it like that for the moment unemployed there's two people we've got two spaces here we'll release them that's fine we really do need to get medical professionals doing the medical work. Okay, why have you not... You say you've completed that. You've not completed it. I'm going to keep asking you to do it until you have done it. Let's put that like that. See if you're going to do it now. Could be this mountain or this bit here that's getting in the way. And I don't really want to delete that rock formation. Okay, so what I've been doing is I've been leveling the ground to get rid of this shallow water area, the, shop, the flooding. I want to retain the lakes. Um, I don't want to get rid of them. I think they're quite a nice feature, especially once we start bringing trees in. Over here, we have one person homeless. Seems to be an outbreak of homelessness. And four vacant work slots. So, I'm going to put some more accommodation in here. I'd like to do these, but I just think this, we haven't got enough um, electrical parts being produced yet. Our solar generator is about to come online. We've got one person unemployed and one person homeless. What I will do is I'll move them over to here once that is built. And we've got two people homeless and one person unemployed. They can be moved over there. There'll be sufficient space over there to take them in. We could also really move them down, of course, over to here where we will be having a larger complex. But I want to try and allow for a bit more expansion than what I've got in population. Currently the shuttle is out on a mission to collect meteorites and bring them down. So that is something we're milestone going to need to... achieved. We have achieved a milestone. Once that gets back, we'll send it out on a new goal. Power production is now plenty for the moment. Has this got an electrical way? Should it have one? Right, it's not, yeah, it needs to be connected, I'm sure of it. Okay, something like this would probably be best to have solar panels around looking at it. We'll need to think about that in the future. Um, we could put a couple of solar panels in quite easily, fit them in. Come on. Two. Uh, 
power down there. Three. We could put three in like that. And what we could do is, as we build this up, we may be able to get rid of that turbine and just move, move that down. How's he doing over here? Looks like getting rid of this bit over here is proving more difficult than I planned. See so if we can level this bit. Maybe it's the amount of land it's getting on the other side. It's not enough. Let's see if we can get rid of that bit. Okay, the power production is 1,000. So we can really start getting rid of some of these. So let's dismantle that. Resources are low. We're going to need power to those um, solar panels. Which is going to... I'm going to take that straight across like that. Okay, that here can now be dismantled. So I'm going to do that, and what I will do is I will see you after. And this, I suppose, is a major step forward because now we're no longer relying on the weather to be able to generate power. And we're in the happy position that we have, we're in a happy position that we have more than enough power at the moment. But we don't want to lose any more. So I think our next priority would be to build another artificial sun. Then maybe we might even be able to get rid of this fusion reactor. So I think that's an option that we have. One building not working, we know about that, we need doctors. The only way to get them down here I've decided is to build another dome here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to link these two domes by moving this casino into this area here. Let's make sure there's some vacancies here as well. There's three unemployed, so that was probably just as well. These are putting out more power. What I can do is I could actually build more round in this sphere of influence and we have the ability to make a bit more power here via solar panels. Just going to quick do a quick survey, make sure all of these wind turbines are now gone.
and that should make a Research major difference complete. to the profile and to the whole landscape. Now we've got more research complete. Anomaly well, found. We've got two shuttles coming back. Let's get them in. One there, one there. An anomaly has been found here. Let's get our science vessel here, over here. And that's where we'll leave it. I think it I think this is possibly a very good place to leave it. So I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to thank you for your support. Please leave a comment. If you want to name one of these cities, or one of these domes should I say, or whether you want to name one of the lakes up here or the lake down here, please leave a comment. Remember to ring that bell and I'll catch you next time.